hey what's up guys so in this video i'm going to show you how you can unlock bootloader of windows 8.1 devices so i have already made a video about it actually a long time ago but this will be much easier than that one and also i will explain everything in this video so the main reason why you're going to unlock bootloader of your windows 8.1 device is to just site load application like games and apps only offline games and apps will work on windows 8.1 devices uh, because as you know windows is long dead so we can still use old applications and games so for that i'm using lumia 920 here and there are two types of device available in windows phone spec a device spec b device both type of device can be unlocked in similar manner but they uses different types of files so i will show you both of them how you can unlock so for spec a device i have lumia 920 here and for spec b i have lumia 930 here both of them actually running on windows 8.1 let me show you so windows phone so both of them now right now running on windows 8.1 and this trick should work on almost all the devices running on windows 8.1 there are few devices will not work on this trick like uh, lumia maybe 535 and lumia 1320 so these two devices may not work but you can give it a try so as you can see both of them running on windows 8.1 one of them windows 8.1 update and another one windows 8.1 basically i will unlock lumia 920 here but i will show you on lumia 932 because it is a spec b device so now on my computer screen so the files we need for unlocking bootloader are listed here so as you can see here the files we need first of all we have to install windows universal tool the main reason why we have to install in windows universal tool is that we can download apps and games from that application and also all these links will open in windows universal tool and it will be downloaded by windows universal tool so we have to install windows universal tool first and i did install it as you can see here windows universal tool then we have to download engineering sbl3 so engineering sbl3 files required for windows spec a devices for spec b devices they use different file and we need wp internals tool to unlock the bootloader and also we can flash and download the stock ffu file using wp internals tool we need windows device recovery tool the windows device recovery tool comes with all kinds of driver needs for these devices and we need emergency payloads for both of them for unlocking bootloader we need donut ffu and x upload unlocker to unlock the bootloader again permanently and there are two more tools these tools required only for side loading the application so this video will be in the two part actually in the first part i will show you how we can unlock and in the second part i will show you how we can side load application so let's begin with the unlocking process so as i said i have already downloaded all the files here so this is rm821 is my lumia 920s files and rm1045 is for lumia 930 so first of all we have to copy some files here actually and for that we need our stock ffu file so we will download the stock ffu by wp internals tool so we will open wp internals tool and we'll connect our device so as we are going to unlock lumia 920 so we'll connect lumia 920 so if i connect it so wp internal stores is open as you can see here now as you can see all the devices and we can go to info section So as you can see here, our device is connected and you can see RM821. Now we have to download our FFU file. So to download the stock firmware, we will go to download section. And as you can see, I have changed the path of download. So it's, it's in desktop for convenient. And you can search here and it will show our FFU file here and we can download it. So you can click and download selected it will download the firmware and it will be on your desktop or wherever you kept that file so in my case as you can see here rm821 and if i open the folder as you can see here the file is here ffu and in the case of lumia 930 or spec b device 
you have to download the file in the similar manner to so going with the bootloader unlocking process we need to put few more files so we need uh, for spec add devices we need sbl3 engineering file and you can you have to copy that file to your lumia like rm 800 21 there so uh, lumia 920 so as you can see lumia 920 is not here because i have already copied to the folder so if i go to here so if i go yes as you can see engineering sbl3 lumia 920 bin so this is the file and also we have to download a few other files so we can go to lumia emergency payloads we will go to spec air lumia devices we will go to lumia 920 and rm 821 and we'll so we will copy all these files to our Lumia 821 folder. So as you can see here, I have already copied all the files. So if I open and there are all the files and there is also donor FFU. Uh, the link is there actually. So you can download that. So we have donor FFU here. Uh, for spec V devices, Lumia RM 1045. So if I open, there are a few files like uh, EDP file, EDE file and the stock firmware. And also we do need donor ffu so donor ffu is here so i did not put it here anymore just select it so now in case of lumia 930 or spec v device we'll open our internal tool and just if i connect the device it should be connected so as you can see here our device is connected lumia 45 and now if we press unlock bootloader and press ok it will boot the device into flash mode and we need to select all the files after that we can unlock the device so now as you can see here we have first of all we have to select our ffu file we can press change and as you can see 1045 we can select that and we have to select ede file here so we are going to change and we will go to ede section ede and we have to select donor file here change and as the file is in different folder i will go to it and select it so after that if you press unlock the bootloader will be unlocked and there is one more process which i will show you with this device because i'm not going to unlock this device right now so now we will put abroad and boot this device into normal mode so for spec a devices so like lumia 920 will connect the device and as you can see here our device is connected now we have to select the files so we will go to unlock bootloader section press ok and the device will boot into flash mode again so let's wait so now the device is booted and as you can see it is asking us to select the files First of all, we will select our FFU file, select FFU and RM 821 or in case of you, it could be anything and select the folder or emergency flash full loader. So we'll click here and select the folder. So desktop and we'll select RM 821, select the folder. Now we have to select engineering SBL3 file. So select it and we'll select our engineering SBL3 file for Lumia 920 and open it and lastly we have to select our donor ffu change and then open now we have to press unlock and have to wait for few minutes actually so in this process you should not interrupt uh, if you interrupt your device might be bricked and in that case you have to flash your stock firmware again and in this process your device will reboot it several times you don't do anything just let it do its thing so it might take Two, three minutes or in the case of yours it might take few more minutes extra but it should not take long actually so now it is unlocking as you can see part one is going on so let's wait so the bootloader is unlocked our device is booted into mass storage mode so as you can see here now if you open your file explorer you will see main os section here as you can see main os e you should not delete or do anything here now we can just minimize the windows internals tool and open our x upload unlocker we'll open that and press yes when it's ask you for permission 
so it is open now so it will detect your menu OS section as you can see here and we'll click on keep it permanent and you tick here and press unlock and the device is unlocked now so now you can like side load application here now what we have to do we have to reboot device back to our main OS so we'll press our power button and volume down button together for several seconds and it should boot the device now device is vibrated and it is turning on you can see that the device is booting so our device is booted up as you can see here and when it's unlocked you don't really see any difference between locked and unlocked device just when you side load application in that case it will allow you to side load application so as for now our device is unlocked and we can like side load application so that's all about unlocking process and i will see you in the second part